If you donate to the Canadian Cancer Society, you might assume that most of your donation goes right into research, as the saying goes, to find a cure. Well, CBC News has learned that is not the case, and Erica Johnson has more now on where your donation actually goes. This started after we were contacted by Brian Lichty, who's a cancer researcher at McMaster University in Hamilton. And over the years, he's received hundreds of thousands of dollars in support from the Canadian Cancer Society, but says they've told him this year he's going to have to look elsewhere for funding, and so are a number of his colleagues. So we analyzed the financial reports for the society, and we noticed a trend that year after year, proportionally, they are allocating less and less money for research. It's down from over 40% in the year 2000 to less than 22% today. And where we're seeing the greatest increase proportionally is they are funding fundraising and administration. Now, we wanted to talk to the Canadian Cancer Society about why this shift in priorities, but they wouldn't give us an on-camera interview. They did say in an email they strongly support research, but they also support other areas like advocacy, education, prevention. However, when we looked at the financial reports for those categories, that funding has basically remained steady. The biggest increase, again, has been for fundraising and administration. Now, cancer researcher Brian Lichty says he still wants people to donate to the Canadian Cancer Society, but he says if they're concerned about the lack of support for research, that they should vocalize those concerns when they donate. Erica Johnson, CBC News, Vancouver.